Somebody backed into my vehicle. This is what it is, guys. Can't move it because um, the fender is jammed into the tire. It's light, so. Love how the, the car left its paint on there. And um, the good thing is that we do have a suspect and I'm not sad or I'm not down or anything like that it's just that it's a lot of work that went into this car and I just wrapped um, the bumper right there so I don't have to do it again and as you can see that right here was something I did by mistake and it came out looking good so now I gotta repeat that looks like I probably got some damage inside here this whole, this entire fender has to um, be replaced. There it is. This is why I call it Dirty Crew, because it's always dirty. I might have to reorder the splitter again. that's pushed in all the way but it looks like it's pushed in a little bit and today today is Sunday so the good thing is that's the only damage so far that I know of. luckily it wasn't the other side of the car or anything else just a bumper and I know I just recently wrapped it so I can do this all over again yeah. We're good. I got new tires actually. Got some um you see I'm still trying to make a video here and I'm kind of down but I'm not too down about it because it's just a car. 225 45. I got some new tires gonna be a little bit thicker on those. Well, not with a sidewall, it's gonna be a little thicker. I was gonna go with the um, Falcon tires, but they didn't have them in a 45. And the reason why I'm going with a 45 is because I got too many potholes in, out here in Florida. So, I mean, they're not gonna be that much bigger than these tires, but they a little bit more of a smoother ride. You know, the OEM tires that come on the car is a 55. So the sidewall is huge. So 45 is probably, uh, you know, that's half. Actually, that's the car that hit me over there, guys. The guy parked the car right across from me. You must be just intoxicated, though, for you to just park your car right across from me. <sighs> but whatever, I got all the information I needed. And I'm not gonna put that guy's information here on the internet, but that's bumper on his car and there's the paint chips on the floor on the ground um, yeah this is it um, put some rivets in the spoiler and um, I got a little tiny spider there on top of it. I like it I was getting ready to, um, actually um, I have ZZP on this side, performance. So right now I'm gonna have a new exhaust on here, um, which will include the ZZP. It's not, it's the, the, not the mid pipe, but it's the up pipe I think, that's gonna come down from the engine, from the um, down pipe. I already have that in the house, so. I mean, I've been holding on to it for a while, but I do have a down pipe. And I have a, and from the back, I just have a vibrant res resonator and this Magnaflow. So what I'm going to do is add that, um, that cat back and we'll go from there. But right now, I got to get a new bumper. My kids That's love right. going to school in this car. 
This car is like a like a little race car, NASCAR for them. They love when I pick them up in this car and love when I drop them off. At the end of the day, man, it is what it is. Shit happens, man, but you can't get too down. It's a fun little project I'm doing here, man. And uh, just wanted to share a quick little video with you guys. So yeah, all right guys, so stay positive. Just know that shit happens. We can't get too down. Life is more important than the material thing, so it can be fixed. So, you guys, thank you for all y'all support, man. Thank you for tuning in. Yeah.